I tend to differentiate between uh, joy and fun. Now you will now compl uh, I, I will immediately uh, opt for joy and I will poo-poo the fun and you will say, well, there's this grumpy theologian talking how fun isn't really fun, right? And we shouldn't be having fun but should have something elusive like, like joy. Now genuine and deep joy is a joy about something good that is actually happening to us. That's what joy is. Or it, it, is, it is kind of affective appreciation of something that we truly consider to be good. So joy always have a, what philosophers call, intentional object. Now it's different with fun. You can just have fun. As a matter of fact, you can take a fun pill. Right? Uh, for, uh, I, I've never smoked weed, but for some people... <laughs> I never inhale, no. <laughs> but that may, be, that may be example, right? It kind of alters the state of your feelings without changing anything about the world. You are not r r having fun with regard to something. You're just feeling chill, feeling good, <laughs> right? On the whole, I don't have much against uh, feeling good, but... The kind of pleasure is, as the ancient philosophers, uh, philosopher Seneca has put it, is a thin pleasure laid on as a coating. And that's exactly what happens, right? It's kind of a very surface pleasure in which you are pulled to forget what's going on underneath, but whatever's going underneath stays always, and your relation to it stays uh, the same. Fun simply takes you out of it for the moment, lets you forget it. Joy is very different. Joy is a rejoicing over something, enjoying properly something that is actually there and appreciating something that is actually there. 